So here we have the B550 Pro 4 from ASRock and this is the motherboard that I was waiting for and it looks like it survived the rough treatment of the delivery guy. I chose this motherboard because it's one of the best for the price I think for about 100 euros, 100 dollars and it packs a lot of features. Let's see on the back. It has two M.2 slots for SSD and one intact comes with a heatsink. It also has the possibility to expand with the Wi-Fi card if you want to. Obviously without the Wi-Fi card, the motherboard is much cheaper. So that's why I like the possibility of expanding it. Also, you had loads of connectivity. We have in the back four um, USB 3, one Type-C, another USB 3 and two USB um, 2.0, which is great. And all the um, addressable RGB and RGB headers, which I think is pretty great. I don't think I'm going to use a lot of RGB because I want to keep it budget, but yeah, in case I want to, it's good to have. So let's see what's inside. Ooh, it's exciting to open your first motherboard. And we see we have the cable. I guess this is the cable for the SATA SSD. All right. Well, yeah, a DVD, a DVD, oh, who, who uses the, them anymore? Useless, just throw it away. A beefy manual, so that's gonna be a lot of information to go through. Yeah. And uh, I guess this is the back plate. Oh, it's not all metal, it's squeegee at the back. Interesting. Hopefully it's not gonna be too difficult to put it on. And two screws, I guess, for the SSDs, the M.2 SSD. And now let's see the motherboard itself. Ooh, ooh. this looks <laughs> sexy. <laughs> I was so excited to <laughs> pack the, the, this thing. It's the first time the, that I have hands on a motherboard. And like when you first buy one, it's pretty intimidating because they are really difficult to, to choose. There's so many names and stuff. So it's, it's, it's exciting to finally have one in your hand. You come with this anti-static bag. Oh, I love the sound, it's so satisfying. I want to unpack it. Yeah. Here is a piece of foam at the bottom. I guess to avoid scratching it at the back. And wow, I mean, <laughs> I don't um, I don't know how it works, but it looks pretty good. I I love the the metal the aluminum finish and the contrast between the white and the black and the metal colors. Here we have the four slots for this for the RAM and the the connectors for the for the fans but yeah this is it it's pretty interesting i'm so looking forward to actually put everything together and see if it actually works because after how it's been treated during the shipping i'm not so sure about it yeah so we'll see